Cornerstone Design at Minds is the introduction uh, for all students at Minds uh, to design, to open-ended problem solving. We bring students in, put them in teams to work on a problem over the course of the semester. We don't give the students a canned problem on a silver platter to which there's a solution that they would converge to. Instead, we have the students um, define their own problem. So the project that we're working on this semester is for uh, the Colorado Department of Transportation. We're increasing bicyclists and pedestrian safety on the road. Bikers will oftentimes go into intersections when it's not their time and they will cause collisions with cars. Our team has decided to utilize dedicated short-range communication chips in cars and put them on pedestrians as well so that the cars and pedestrians can get warnings when they're approaching each other too close or if there's possibly a pedestrian in the crosswalk. So our idea is that you have a raising and lowering speed bump in the bike lane along with a stoplight specifically for bikes so that bikers are forced to slow down. Their main goal is to, uh, is to replicate uh, the workplace environment. Uh, most problems in a workplace aren't a yes or no answer, aren't a multiple choice answer. Recruiters have told us countless times that they're looking for students that not only just get along on a team, but actually can engage in civil discourse and actually debate effectively and question their colleagues and take feedback and incorporate that into their ideas. I've learned a lot of problem solving skills where you kind of take everyone's ideas and you mash them together and you throw everything you've got out there and you refine it till you've got a great idea. What we are trying to give them an opportunity to do is realize that there isn't a single right answer. There may actually be many different approaches to the problem depending on the context as they define it, which stakeholders they identify as being the most important to satisfy. And the unique part of what we introduce is really kind of defining the problem through a user's perspective. And so I think um, to me, it's really important that not only do we think about the problem from our perspective as a designer, as the engineer, as a scientist, but as well as incorporating the views of who's using this final product. This class is definitely important. It is used in every field. Uh, project management is used in almost any career. And just overall, how to present, how to talk to a group, how to make something look professional. Uh, very important for any discipline, really. Mine's, uh, I think, recognizes that when our students are looking for jobs, ultimately, that this is what the recruiters are looking for. Can a student think on their feet? Can a student um, apply a methodology when they're faced with an impossible problem. Students come in and they have to realize for the first time that they're not going to um, know all the answers to every problem and they're not going to know how to do everything and they're going to have to use the situation that they're currently immersed in um, to help guide them as to what they need to find out. 